We do my pull ups around Say her. Hi. Uh oh. Yeah, we do pull ups though. That's how we coming. From now uh -huh. on, we doing pull ups. What's poppin', squad? It's your boy Thompson along with my cutty. Call me Stan. <laughs> and we here with another one. But today is a special one though. I'm telling you why. Let me, let me just tell you why. We are trying the Impossible Burger from Burger King. Mm. Ooh. Ooh. That thing is thicker than a snicker. Impossible. It's huge. It's Impossible Burger, brother. I'm gonna show you how to get it. But, you know, since I got my uh, cousin with me today, I can't really have opening, but I can show you what it looks like. Look, 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 look. <sighs> So, for those that may not know, the Impossible Burger is Impossible Meat, which is plant-based, and no cap. It's more healthier for you. Well, just get right into it like you normally do, huh? I shouldn't even be surprised. You don't. But I'm trying to set up for y'all so you can see. Oh, and I got their um, jalapeno peppers. You know, Burger King does have jalapeno cheddar peppers. Can I try one? Can you try one? Let me try it first. Oh, hold on. I gotta do my people one. Y'all want one? Here you go. Go and get you one. Oh, this is bad. Damn, brother. Go and get you one. How's that burger? It's good. Does it taste any different? Can you tell a difference than from this and the Whopper? It tastes more natural. It tastes more natural. Like a bird should be. Is that facts? Man, hey, let me look at these. <laughs> so it has your ordinary Whopper ingredients, lettuce, mayo, pickles. I added cheese to both of them. It looks all right. We gonna see what it is. All right, first bite going in. Impossible Burger, plant-based. Tastes like a regular Whopper. You know, you eat you know, a plant-based burger, brother. Mm -hmm. You know that? Mm -hmm. That's not real meat. I know. That didn't come from no animal. Didn't no animal have to lose his life for us to enjoy this burger? How you feel about that? Okay. You think that's good? All right. They should leave the wildlife alone anyway. Stop killing things. I don't think cows, um, I don't think you can call cows wildlife. Mm. Is that your burger? Mm -hmm. Oh, damn! I'm not, I'm not even halfway finished with this thing. Bruh, oh my gosh. This dude, was you hungry? You was hungry, right? Yeah. Or was you just trying to finesse and see if you can kill this before me? I mean, both. That was your intentions, huh? Both of them, like, okay. Because this burger is huge, you guys. Huge. I'm talking huge. And look, I'm, I mean, can you see the girth on that mobo? And this guy killed his... Damn. That's was good. I can eat another one. Mm, mm, mm. I need to enter you in the eating contest, brother. Cause I'm telling you, you you gonna do some damage, nigga. <laughs> mm -hmm. okay. Matt Stoney, who? Did you try one of these uh, jalapeno peppers? Say nothing. <laughs> yeah, they're good. I was like, all right, say nothing. It's bomb, huh? Yeah, they're good. Mm -hmm. How y'all doing today, squad? Today was a nice day. Beautiful day outside today here in Sac, Cali. It was like 69 degrees. But I hope you guys had a good day. Productive day. There's nothing going on. Go ahead. Right, cool. Sorry if you can't see me too much in the video. It's your boy. Along with my cousin. So funny, funny thing just happened on our way back home. So as we're leaving Burger King, two you young girls was yelling us down. Hey, and I'm over here like, oh, they see two light skinned. You know what it is. Come to Bob's like, what's up? 
Come to find out they needed a jump. <laughs> they was stranded, huh? They was on stuck on stuck. <laughs> and you know what I did? <laughs> what I do, Kozo? We kept it moving. <laughs> <laughs> now, was I wrong for that? Mind you. I just got out the drive through from Burger King. If I was to pull over and help the wet, but first, hold on, let me tell you this. I don't got no jumper cables. And there was some youngsters too. I'm gonna assume, which I shouldn't do, but I'm gonna go ahead and assume that they didn't have no cables either, okay? That's one reason I didn't stop. Second reason is my food's gonna be cold. But I told them to as I was pulling off. I was like, hey, I'm a good dude, but I got something I gotta be. I couldn't do it. I couldn't do it. Would you have done it? Yeah. You would have done it? You know, you just ordered your food and all that. Yeah. And your food would have been cold. Yeah. Oh, you a good dude. It depends on how long it's going to take. I don't know where the cables go. So if I had jumper cables, that can give you a jump. But I'm not a mechanic. So I don't know where to put the cable. On. I know it's a positive, positive, negative, negative. That's right. That's all you need to know. Well, so I know all that, right? I don't have no cables. I don't have any cables in my car. You don't. And secondly, I'm gonna keep it 100. I didn't want my food getting cold because I had to do a video for my people. If our food was not cold, it wouldn't have been. And if, mm -mm, if my food would have been cold, I would have been highly upset. And my, and my squadron would have seen the upsetness on my face. And we can't have that. Because mm -hmm. no. it's happened before. And I just had to get rid of that. All of it. You know what I mean? Spread that all of But this impossible burger. Isn't impossible. Anybody can eat it. It's good. I highly recommend you go try one if you haven't. Because it is plant based meat. So tell and you. I swear, I really can't tell the difference. Tastes just like Whopper one. They really do. And I did add cheese. Like I always will. Always do with a Whopper. It's a big burger though. But these jalapeno poppers, they bad. Finish. I can't believe you're done already. That was quick, bro. You know. Don't doubt. Let me give y'all some game real quick. Be yourself. Majority of the people who watch my videos, they know what I'm talking about because they're older. I have an older audience. You know what I'm saying? But so a lot of them know that already. But if you're young, under 25, be original. You know what I'm saying? Can't nobody be you. So if you're going to put yourself out there in any way or just however you go your everyday life, don't be no clout chaser. You know what I'm saying? Don't be riding nobody's wave. Don't authenticity will go a long way. And don't get me wrong. I know we get we can always be inspired by somebody. You know what I mean? And it's okay to kind of imitate do it differently. what they do. You know what I'm saying? Because there's a saying imitation is the best form of flattery. I mean it is. It's to a certain extent, in my opinion, that you could just imitate a motherfucker. Like, you don't want to imitate everything they do, say everything they say. Just be you. Do it the way you would do it. Don't do it how someone else is already doing it. Because then it's not original. And when people see it, they're going to be like, oh, this dude is clout chasing. Oh, this cat is a biter and whatnot. So all I'm trying to say is be the most authentic person that you can be. No cap there. Because I'm seeing it. Me too. And... Uh, you see it, Kazo? Mm -hmm. See it through. Every, that shit is like every angle. It's funny to me, man. It's hilarious. It's funny. Yeah, I am talking about me right now. I know my mother is biting my shit, riding my way, and I don't know why. I'm just me. I'm just Thompson. I just do me. That's it. But if you're gonna try to do what I do, <laughs> you're not gonna be very successful. You ain't gonna not nah, biting my shit. Okay. Quit biting my shit. Stop biting my shit. You. 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 Right there. You. Right there. No you. Hoodie on. You. You. It's you. Not me. But you, you over there to yeah. the right. <laughs> Stop. Stop it. 
Just be you. Please. Please. But people who rock with me are okay with me being me. Because they should be as well. I am with them. And we're going to give you our review. I'm going to let Cuzzo go first. One out of five. Five being the best. What will you rate that burger? I give it a four. A four, uh, just straight up four. Yes, Why so. would you give it a four? The way know. you swallowed it, it didn't seem like it was a four. I thought that was a ten. Maybe if it was a little bit more presentable. It should be presentable more. What you? It's mean? like I'm trying to tell you, like the burger is uh -huh. like how whoppers come. They're like wait, squished. Like, they're squished? Yeah, like it look mines look like kinda like not flat but flat. I think that's better. That means your um ingredients was uh fresh. Packing. They didn't just smash it. No, I hope not. But yeah. uh and the fries is alright. My fries the fries is always fries, but they're frying it. But you gonna stick with to that four. Okay, yeah. well you gotta I gotta respect your uh review. For me, a five across five. the board, yes, and them um jalapeno cheddar poppers. Five. Fire. So yes, if you haven't tried an impossible plant-based burger from Burger King, I recommend you trying because it will surprise you. But when you go plant-based, it, it costs more. It's like you know you're going I mean? vegan. Yes, exactly. And but also when you go vegan and you buy plant-based meat or vegan products, it's, it's more expensive. expensive yeah. You know, so I you know everybody know me. I don't want to waste my money, mm -hmm. and I think that's for anybody. Don't nobody want to buy something and feel like they wasted their money. But I honestly think that was a very good burger. Check that out. But yeah, man, this is your boy Thompson along with my cousin. The real stand YT. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up. And if you didn't like it, give it a yeah, thumbs damn. down. It's all good. We ain't tripping around these parts. If you like food reviews like I do, consider hitting that subscribe button. But I'll see you guys on the next one. Remember, spread love and not hate and always keep it G. Peace.